Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Only? Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of State of Decay 2 Homecoming. Alrighty, when we left off, we had not been here. Uh, we had been trying to do a few missions to help our buddies nearby. Tressie has a new one for us, but I ended up in this house. I don't remember when I ended up in this house, but that's not the point. Oh, this might be useful. I'm just going to loot what I can. I am carrying a lot of stuff. When did I pick up all that stuff? I don't know. Oh yeah, I was redeeming one of the uh, one of the supply drops that I can get, and it was nearby here. That's why. And then I went to try and loot this place out for got that I should probably offload my crap before I do that. And yeah, my house is right down there. Okay, so Tressie's thing, throwing down the gauntlet. Whoa. She is deep in plague territory. Holy crap. Well, that's gonna take a bit. When did I pick up that? Actually, this is a whole new thing, isn't it? Yeah, a whole different vehicle right here. I don't even think I was driving this. So, well, it's mine now. All right. Throw all of these in there. Because I don't need to be carrying them right now. And I'll get all the goodies that is inside this house. Oop. Helps if I go in the right spot. Yo, anyone wants to trade? We got the goods. Wholesalers, huh? Bag of microwave popcorn. Good luck with this one. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you're right. Hey, it's a luxury item. Might as well pick it up. Oop. Shit. Whoopsie doopsie. Well, I'm in trouble. Oh, more nine rounds. More 45s. 1911. Nice. Dirty green. Oh, hello. Time to knock some people over. Damn bambos getting knocked out. Ow. Hey, get, get off of me. Down you go. Bye. Man, having that quick kill button is so nice. A quick, unalive button. I should be careful with the word choice. <laughs> Anywho. Let's search this one. Ooh, shotgun shells. I'm okay with that. Molotov, if only I had put away <laughs> some of my other stuff. Carving knife, not even worth picking up. Really? What else do we got going on here? Not much in the way of searchable containers. Maybe outside. I guess it could be. Wait. I, I just noticed it as I went over the fence. Buggery. And okay. Time hey. to put this place behind us. Cool. Sounds good to me. I'm gonna put one more thing into the van and then get that gas can to make the van work for moi. Oh crap. I can't do that. <laughs> Oh, Hello to all balls. the citizens of Trumbull Valley. This is Lily Ritter with the network. Yes. I'm reaching out because I'm worried about my friend Ray Santos. Oh, the wandering he trader's right there. Answering his radio, and I'm Ooh. getting a little worried. I'm sure it's nothing, but I'd appreciate it if someone could check and make sure everything is okay. No. Oh, that's a horde. Ah, crap. Or if it isn't a horde, it basically... Yep, no, it's a horde. Crap. Well, hi there. Didn't see you there, bud. And now no one's going to see you ever again. Bye-bye. Ah. Uh, time to run away now. A little bit. Down, down, whoop, ah. Ah. 
Okay. Come back. Keep on moving. Keep on moving. Whoop. Okay. All right. Gotta keep on swinging. And goodbye. Would have gone badly. Nothing here. Let's hope the next one's a winner. Oh. I figured they were in. <laughs> I figured they were in the mart. That's yeah, going. Well, how you doing, wholesalers? Let's get down to business. Why not? Materials. Okay. Alright, I'm okay with this. I'll sell you this because it's worthless to moi. Uh, it's dirty green. It's a good color, but at the same time, I don't really use the standard backpacks anymore. The vicinity of Bozeman Pass. This is your final warning to clear out. Uh, Operation Drawbridge will create a choke point through the mountains. A uh, mighty wall between us and the Zeds. Uh, damn, that sounds pretty badass. Yeah, but, um, I don't know where that is. I'm not, I'm not sure. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm not sure if there's anything else here I really want. Sledgehammer is not really worth it. Uh, mm -hmm. package of duct tape. That's always nice. How's my... Uh, my materials stockpile is pretty low, but I could easily get more. Uh, I don't know if Let's I want to spend influence just sure. to get that. Uh, screw it. Screw it. Screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it. Uh, you think you can keep up with me? Let's see. Let's see how that works, huh? Oh, he, they, they actually put me in the work. All right. You did. You damnedest. And I can appreciate that. I can appreciate that. I gotta rest a sec. No, it's fine. You'll be fine. Uh, gas can. That's what I needed. I was going to throw it into the passenger van. That's what was. That's what the perturbator. I want to see if the <laughs> the seat is too high for that maneuver to actually work. If you went around the seat, that that'd be one thing. Oh, the gas. Okay, just be at the back end of the van. That's how you make that work. All right. Cool. Should I put an improvised on the M4 even if it's not all that good? I don't use the gun all that much anyway. It's not like it would damage it faster all that often. Okay, yeah, fine. I'll put it on. I'll put it on. If only to free up more space. I shouldn't have done that. Why did I do that? God damn it. <laughs> Doug, damn it, damn it, owner of the Dimsdale, damn it, damn. Okay, I'll take the ammo just to put this in. And ta-da. Call that good. Uh, I also noticed there is stuff in this building. But I want to double check if there was anything good that I left behind in here. Well, hi there. Thanks for joining us. Now you're dead. Sowie. We can't ever repay the sheriff for all the help, but hopefully the stuff we just dropped off will start to cover it. Eh, I mean, clear to me. it helps. It was this one that had Molotov, an extra Molotov. All the help we can get to clear out plague hearts. Molotovs are a decent start. Very decent start. Very decent start. Alright, I should have checked this. Why did I jump over the fence if I'm just going to have to go again? Uh, <laughs> I'm so dumb. Well, that was noisy. Well, yeah, and? 
Well, it's not much. It's still something. And More I need that. healing anyway. So, win-win. Ooh, gas station jacket. Big Daddy Auto Repair. Cool. Bundle of Carpentry Supplies. I guess I should take that. Especially well, combined with louder. the duct tape that I picked up. It could have been louder. But it's not going to be an issue. Because I'm already out of here. Okay. And with that done, we'll head home first before we do that. Uh, okay, we just back up out of this curve, which I can easily do backwards, probably. Hey, I did it. Now we head this way, I think it was. Yes, yes, it was this way. Haha. -ha. Constantly checking the map because I'm never sure of my surroundings. Because I have the sense of direction of a rock. Oh, alright. You are kidding. You are kidding me. Son of a bitch. Feral incoming! Not anymore. <laughs> Alright. Well, I might as well use these to offload. Done. Make them last. My crud. All of it. There we go. I'll use the passenger van to head over to Tressy. Pick that up. That, 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 and that's and that. Heavy. Oh, it's fine. You'll live. You know what I'll do? I'll put this away because we can carry two. I keep forgetting we can carry two. Because I'm a dumb. And put all of these in. And that. And ta-da. Uh, let me see. Is there anything I can do with my current... No, there isn't. I have run out of options for Checkpoint Delta. Crap. I could put the signal antenna in, though. Another one would be nice. I'm already at storage 2. There's no reason to do more, I don't think. That's not terrible, but... Uh, I have not enough beds. Uh, I'm going to have to start looking to move somewhere else. Jilly Bean. Let's look at that gas station jacket, shall we? Big Daddy Auto Repair. When you need it fixed right the first time, call Big Daddy. Anyway. It does look pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. It looks pretty damn cool. But it doesn't go with our motif of leather jacket and cowboy hat. Because I am nothing if not a overarching cliche. So, uh, <laughs> I, think, I think we're all good. Yeah, I think we're all good for now. It's not the button I wanted to hit. I wanted to hit this one. There we go. Okay. Head over to Pressy. That's good to hear. Yeah. And my inventory is light. I'm not entirely sure if I actually want to try going for one of the plague hearts down there in Marshall to make it a little easier. I'd say it's probably worth it. But I just don't know if I have the supplies that'll actually help take it out. I know it's too damn crowded around here. The first ones are usually easy. Yeah, I know it's crowded. We'll be working on that. Uh, let's see. Looks like we got zombies moving in. Everybody back to base. Yeah, well, good thing I'm already here. I'll take six Molotovs. Prepare to home for Zambambo attack. I'll help Tressie in a bit. It'll be right after we deal with this. 
Oh, there's another Miragora. I should devote time to that. Joe, we're under attack here at base. But I'm right here. You don't have to say it like I'm not aware. Send those fuckers back to hell. I mean, yeah. I don't know if they specifically came from hell, but I mean, the likelihood is high. Yet. Rollins? Is anyone gonna step up and take charge around here? Yeah, I was about to say, it seems like Rollins is pretty much doing that for me. <laughs> Down you go. Incoming wave! Eyes up! The fight isn't over yet! And say? I just realized that Nsei and Rollins basically sound the same, and they're both in military attire. <laughs> it is unfortunate that I have two people that sound exactly the same. It throws off my head quite a bit. Oh, hi! Hi! Clear infestations. That's actually a thing that's going to be changed in a recent update. In a recent update, as in, uh, in the future. Uh, how those interact with the world. I am looking forward to that, but I... I... Doubt that things would be going this well. well, I mean, neither did I, but... Then again. <laughs> okay, let's head over to... Head it over the turret. I can talk, really, I can. I do it for a living. Uh, I'm heading over to Tressy now. And while I'm there, I'll take care of a plague heart. Who knows? Maybe uh, what Tressie's quest involves is dealing with a plague heart. That'd be nice. That would be very nice. Whoop a doo. Okay. All right. This is a bit of a horde. Bye. There we go. And that deals with all of them. Man, oh man, maneuvering with this passenger van is going to be a problem. <laughs> ah, see what I mean? All right. Yeah, you thought you could hang on. Yeah, nice try. Pop. Pop. I do and... not want to know what makes plague territory smell this bad. Uh, probably all the rot and decay and, you know, dead people, you know, kind of par for the course. Dead people tend to make things smell bad. Because, you know, nature of being dead and all. Hey, thanks for coming by. Come on in and I'll explain my plan. Alright, sounds good to me. Oh, this fire station looks like it was fortified at some point. I'm assuming by the military. Yeah, this is all definitely suggesting that to me. Okay. I saw claimed by Plague Heart and I thought, oh, it's in this building. But the answer was no. Well, I mean, yeah, you could. I need fresh samples to test a new theory. Can you provide backup? Can you tell me more? Before now, I've avoided the most overgrown areas because they're so dangerous. That's why I need you watching my back. If that's the case, I'm going to need more people. I will be back, Tressie. I'm not ignoring you. I just need more people. Oh, well, come on. There we go. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, I'm going to need at least one more person with me. Because last time, helping Tressy with that one mission near the crashed airplane 
That was insanity and a half. I don't want to risk doing that again without backup. Okay, Zed's around, but we can't secure the place with a plague heart close by. Very true. Very true. We will deal with that plague heart, though. At least the first one will be easy. The uh, question is, will it be easy enough with only Molotovs in my inventory? The answer? I don't know. Well, we do have buddies here. The remainders. I mean, I don't have to go all the way back to base if I ask them. Plus, I have influence to spare. It's good to see your ugly mug. Get in here. Ugly? Hey, hey Arnold. How you been? I was going to ask you, but now I'm not sure. Uh, learn about you. Your wits are pretty high, but everything else is kind of meh. It's new, buddy. But you. Well, you're already specialized in stealth, which I don't necessarily need. At least for combat. And everything else is rather low. Good to see you, buddy. Joe! Hey, how you doing? Your shooting's actually pretty good, but your fighting... Wow. You must be really bad at fighting. That's unfortunate. But your shooting is good enough. You'll have to do it. Hey, you're still alive? Yeah. Hey, can you come help me out with something? Vamos. Hey. Caete, vato. Let's go. And he's going to jump <laughs> to the passenger seat through the headrest. Oh. Okay. This, like I said, maneuvering with this passenger van is not going to be easy. You had, Joe, you had the perfect opportunity and you wasted it. Boy. Bato, come on. Let's not be a pendejo. Oh, fuck. Just spotted the contagious one. Yeah, unfortunately, there's going to be a lot of them around here. Oh, hello. That was the wrong direction. All right. There you go. That's a good one. All right. Woo. All right. Come on with me. Oh, come on. I thought that was... <laughs> No, you go down. I ain't letting you hurt Joe. He's one of my buddies. God damn it. Get out of here. Alright, I'm gonna pick up this plague sample. Alright, Joe. Let's get over to Tressie. You're helping me help her. Well, hey. It is what it is. So, you up for helping me out? Absolutely. Oh, cool. Yeah. I hope you're geared up. This one's going to be a bit of an adventure. Yeah, I'm as geared up as I'm going to be. Travel with Tressie Huerta to a certain ruined plague wall in Marshall. What do you mean by a certain? We need to clear out the Zeds before I can get the... <laughs> yeah, I figured as much. Clear out all zombies from the area around the plague wall so Tressie can search. Yeah, we can do that. Alright. Down you go. Eventually? There we go. Give me just a moment. My throat's acting up once again. Because, fuck me, I guess. Was a little dry. Makes it a little scratchy. Okay. Moving on. You should be quick. But keep on your toes while I get my samples. Well, of course. Here's hoping we don't have the same issue we did from the last one. Clear all zombies the from the, the second uh, plague wall. Army guys used to call this area the gauntlet. Really? Must have been pretty terrifying when the walls were still alive. I bet. Okay. 
They used to call it the gauntlet. I gotta imagine that was the case. No other reason to call it the gauntlet. Mm, this one doesn't look so promising either. Let me make sure, but I suspect I'll come up empty here. Okay. Yeah, this one's a total bust. We need to keep moving. Damn. Final that ruin feels really one. sketchy to me. Look, we need to get as far into the gauntlet as we can. It won't be easy because the place is still crawling with zombies. Of course. But it stands to reason that a wall closer to the source could be more viable. I mean, the you make a good of point. What? The source of whatever destroyed all of these walls. My breakthrough was recognizing how nature is aggressively reclaiming the dead walls. That's why I need samples from walls approaching the maximum state of decay. Uh huh. Wait a. Wait one. God's damn. Cotton pick in second. Y'all put the name of the game in a dialogue line. And y'all didn't expect me to congratulate y'all fucking well done. <laughs> well fucking done. <laughs> well fucking done. Oh my god, that's beautiful. They said it! They said the thing! They said the thing! They said the thing! <sighs> so beautiful okay enough of my bit <laughs> let's get moving searching this hello sweet mama <laughs> all right let's check this one Blech. boring what do you mean boring what do you mean boring talking about so about these infestations time to do something we will do something soon don't you worry about that right now though i'm kind of happy i have a silencer on this one. Oh well hi there good thing indeed i ain't letting you fucking do anything topped up since I'm already at two stacks of ammo for this gun. Keep topped up as much as possible as I traverse this hellhole. Ah, this is not a path that is viable for me, is it? Uh, crud. Okay, well, this road's in the bus. I guess we'll have to go this way around. Yeah. Still, good thing I took out a freak. Before it had a chance to fuck things up. So that's not an option. Further this way we go. Board it up. Board it up. And I guess we go around this way. There doesn't seem to be as many plague zombies... I'm going to take As my I expected. time here, just to be sure I get good samples. That means I'm counting on you to keep us both alive. Cool. And you're going this route around because... The route I took worked just as well? You just walk in over a car like it's nothing. Okay. Starting now. Keep your eyes open. Uh -huh. What was that noise? Barrel incoming. Whoops. There we go. Anyone got a bucket of grenades for the big guy? Good question. And I'm trying another spot now. At least I got the fucking. At least I got the screamer. 
Oh, come on. I don't want to keep shooting Joe on accident. Ow. Ow. Bastard, stop it. Well, I mean, that's hope, isn't it? Oh, boy. Oh, you're kidding me. Gotcha. No. Well, as long as you get my back now. Okay. Okay. Ow. Need a breather. Yeah, a little bit. Okay. Well, we're gonna be in trouble if we don't get out of here quick. Yeah. Thanks, Joe. Thanks for the understatement. Any other bright statements you want to be making? Oh, ow. Quit targeting Joe. Come on now. All right, beautiful. Oh, beautiful, Joe. Beautiful. Beautiful, Joe. Shoot me. You feel free to just shoot me for that one. Defeat the remaining zombies. Uh, yeah, you could. But that's not the point. There's... Or just escape with Tresi Huerta. Well, I mean, that's an option. Might as well take that option. Ah, oh, crap. Ow, you bastard. Alright. When you're safe, or group by talking with Tressy Huerta. You were great out here. Ready to head back? Uh, yeah, let's call it a day. Sounds good. All right, let's move on before any more Zeds come around to say hi. Yeah, let's do that. Lead on. All right. Sounds good to me. Where'd I leave my car? That's the question of the hour, isn't it? Where'd I leave my car? Dude, where's my car? Uh, there. Well, let's drop her off at her house before we do anything My else. Told me field work was challenging, but I don't think they had this in mind. Oh, they absolutely did not. I can guarantee that. Why aren't you following me? You guys, why aren't you following me? Why aren't you following me? Come on. Okay. No Zed's around, but we can't secure the place with a play cart close by. Are, are we going to eventually... What is with the pathfinding? What is with the pathfinding for these guys today? Alright. Not sure what's up. But I'm just going to assume... This is some sort of shenanigans due to the plague wall. That's what I'm going to assume. Unless we take out some infestations, we're going to have a siege on our hands. Are we going to do... Well, there's Joe. Once again, you there we go. For me Finally, they teleported. <laughs> I won't forget that. You're welcome. So what's next? More science? You better believe it, my friend. I'm talking about a three-scoop Sunday of scientific method with some sciency hot fudge on top. Mm, damn it. Now I want ice cream. Better work on that next. Eh. <laughs> you take care of yourself. Yeah, absolutely. Spreading the word with an influence bonus. Hells yeah. I'm okay with that. I'm perfectly okay with that. But first I'm going to take Joe home. Or I can go ahead and take care of that plague heart right there. I do have the inventory to do that already. Yeah, 
Yeah, why not? Why not? All I need to do is throw a few Molotovs. Not that big a deal. Not that big a deal. Probably switch to the nine, though. It says there's a horde here. Do you mind waiting a sec? If you would... <laughs> Joe, I am not sure what your pathfinding issue is. But, buddy... Bye-bye. And... Oh! It's in one of these. It's even easier. I keep hitting the wrong button. I keep intending on hitting the map. But instead, I'm hitting the map button for a different game. <laughs> Alright. you oh hey this Joe's helping me now I know why do I keep missing why do I even bother with this guy I keep missing every time oh boy Reload. Reload. Move on. Where's the plague? Oh, right there. Easy to hit. The one of these. Just That's keep on doing it. Start claiming some nearby spots. Hells yeah. Not as much as I would hope, considering, you know, the other play card is right next to it. Do you folks mind helping us out? Bottom feeders. Rolling out the welcome wagon. Uh meet with blue at the house by the crash site. Uh they're sitting in the middle of an infestation. <laughs> Are y'all for real? Already. Alright. What's going okay. on? Uh let's trade hey there, business partner. Cool. Yeah. I don't remember selling you all that, but I must have. <laughs> I must have at some point. Alright, well, whatever. Either way. Dillinger Pattern, 1911. F highly illegal, full <laughs> auto conversion of the M1911. Fitted with a black market drum mag and crude muzzle brake. Probably intended for robbing a bank. Probably. Probably. Double bit axe. I can't complain about that. Police knife. Can't complain about that. Neon green hiking pack. Can't complain about that. Get all of those... All of that, put that in me, and uh, I'll pick all the rest of this up later. But I did what I intended to do, which was take care of a play card. We finally have scratched that off of our to-do list. Can't complain about that. It would have been nicer if it led to something we could actually use. Actually, we can use Fort Marshall. I just need eight people, but we can use Fort Marshall. I just need to get rid of the other one so I can take the Tranquility Any Factory first. Folks out there wanna come over and give me a hand? What's left behind? Meet with Knox to find out what he wants. Uh... I need to get to my car, dude. I need to get to my car first before I do anything else. Because, quite frankly, I am tired. I need to bring Joe home. I need to do... Why is he going this way? 
Why are you going this way? I was avoiding Zambambo strictly because... And the Zambambo with it. Take that, you feral fuck. Yeah. If only. If only. Oh boy. If only you had followed where I was going. You wouldn't have had that issue, Joe. Alright, well, either way, like I said, we're heading to my car, we're going to drop Joe off, I'm going to head home, swap out with someone who is not as tired as I am, because quite frankly, there's only so much left I can do. And Joe is going in a completely weird-ass direction again. Yo, slow down, amigo. Well, follow me, vato. Pendejo. Que la chingada. Alright, well, I'm heading to my car. If he eventually follows me, more the better. Sticking around here too long would not be smart. Well, considering, you know, I'm already in trouble. Trumbull Valley. It's your friendly neighborhood agricultural scientist again. You may have noticed some grass and weeds growing up from the ruins of the old plague walls. This does not mean that the wall debris is actually edible by humans. Please, don't become a cautionary tale for others to learn by. Well, I mean, that seemed obvious to me, but... Brother, what are you doing? This is why you don't take weird pathways. Alright. Well, it's going to take the rest of the episode just to get to my car at this rate. Because Joe keeps taking weird paths. Joe, what are you fucking doing? Oi, que la chingada. <sighs> Vato, that's the last time I'm taking you with me. Well. out of my inventory. Get that, get that. And... Yeah, get that, I guess. Alrighty. Alright, you are going home, bud. You are going straight to hell home. Hoi. Oh, ah, of course. Ah, of course. Taking you home, and then I'm going home. And I'm swapping out with Tom or someone at the nearby base to where your home is. So then I can do the other thing for Knox or whoever the hell that guy is. Another muerto over there. Yeah, there's multiple muertos. It's in the middle of Marshall. Multiple muertos that you could shake a stick at. Here you Here's are. a tip from someone who found out the hard way. A house without a top-end workshop isn't a home. It's an oversized coffin. Te game. All right. Head on Bina home. Suerte, amigo. Bina suerte. 
Okay. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take some of the stuff out of here. Because I can drop it off here, no issue. There we go, there we go, there we go, and there we go. And... You know what? Screw it. It's swapping out anyway. Alright. That was noisy. Well, yeah. It is what it is. Okay. Drop off that, that. That, 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 and that. And... I guess... That's about all I need to do. And now, I swap out for Tom. Because, boy, does Dawn need a rest. <laughs> okay. Tom time. Alright. Let's go. And with that... We are doing pretty well for ourselves. And we can move on to helping Knox, whoever this guy is. There we go. All right, I'm heading out now. Gracias, amigo. Is that how I sound? <laughs> is that how I sound when I speak Spanish? <laughs> Just overly white. Is that is that how it sounds when I do it? Oh boy, it's probably true. It's probably true. Please don't tell me because <laughs> it's probably true. All right. Anyway, I'm gonna do that. But first, I gotta end this episode because it is over time already. So. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and helping Tressie with a big project. Trying to get more samples off of the plague walls. And taking out a juggernaut and a... F I think it was also another screamer. And a... F uh... What was it? Uh, feral. There we go. That's the word. For some reason, that freak just kept coming into my mind, but I knew that's just the general term. And just a hell of a lot of zombies. Uh, Joe was at least help in the combat, but not by much. And uh, yeah, could have been a lot worse. So here's hoping that this opens up a lot more easy to do projects for us. For you.